Teddy Lombardo, up and coming, Epe guy. Yeah. Close to making the cadet team this year. Close, yeah. A little out of contention right now. What, uh, looking back, what things were, were you doing right or, or what might you have done differently to, to kind of lock up that spot? Um, well, there were a lot of tournaments, uh, really close situations. <laughs> um, uh, there were just certain decisions I made. Uh, there were certain points where I could change something up, but um, overall, I you know, give credit to the guys that did make it. They fenced very well. Uh, a lot of respect to those top three guys. <laughs> what, uh, what um, you know, you, you talk about some of the things that you, you yeah. could have maybe switched up. Um, you know, in retrospect, probably using a lot of that to push you forward and continuing to improve. What are you, uh, what are you, what information are you using to now address your fencing? Uh, well, I'm definitely looking at uh, the positives. Um, there are some negatives as well. Um, obviously, you know, I've spoken with my coach about those, and I'm just trying to put those forward and just work to the future. And, uh, I mean, you know, that's just the beginning. I'm ready for juniors next year and seniors hopefully during college, and, you know, it'll be nice. When you're on the strip in practice, then, uh, what is it that you're you're most focused on in your fencing? Um, it really depends. Um, there's some days that I'll work on defense. There's some days I'll work on attack. Uh, it really depends it's based on what the coach decides, and, you know, that's, that's where we'll take it from there and, you know, work for that and bring it into the next turn. Obviously, a lot of positivity here, perspective gained through understanding this is, you know, a very early step in, in a long game. Um, offensively and defensively, what, what, what are you hoping to uh, come into next season with strongest? Um, I mean, both. I know that um, myself as a fencer, I want to be very collective. I want to have a lot of things that I can do. Um, offensively, you can do a lot of things. Defensively, you know, you want to, you know, give yourself a good anchor with that. Uh, if you're down or if you're up, you know, you want to be able to score some touches and parries and counterattacks, so that's obviously a very important thing. Um, but in general, I mean, I want to work physically, uh, mentally, and obviously I have a lot of experience from the past couple of years, so I'm ready to put that on to the future. Yeah. With with the attacks and in, in, uh, in kind of counters and defense, yeah. what um what most defines your fencing as far as your, your, your favorite actions? Uh, I mean, I have a lot. It really depends on the bout. Uh, there are some bouts where I'm doing a lot of counterattacks and you know, I'll be hitting you know, short counterattacks and long counterattacks. Um, there are some bouts where I'll want to attack a lot, so I'll do a lot of flushes. Um, it really depends. Uh, it depends on the fence here. So. All right, keeping it open. Thank you and continue to improve. Awesome, thank you.